Different strains of the novel coronavirus are emerging in different parts of the globe. Scientists say that among the Taiwan cases seen so far, they have identified at least four subtypes of the coronavirus. The earliest cases diagnosed in Taiwan had a subtype very similar to the Wuhan virus. Later on, researchers discovered three other subtypes that originated from the US, Europe and from the Middle East. As the novel coronavirus spreads, it is also undergoing mutations. So far, Taiwan has identified four subtypes of the virus in its patients. Isolate 25 viruses, and from genetic analysis, we found the virus got some diversity, it mutated during the past few months. According to Dr. Shi, the earliest group of patients had a subtype very similar to the Wuhan virus. Later on, Taiwan saw three other versions of the coronavirus. One was imported from the U.S., the other from Europe, and the third from the Middle East. So this is why we need um, many viruses for test. For example, if some uh, antibody or antiviral drugs really can inhibit the early virus but cannot inhibit the recent virus, then the drug cannot be used or the antibody cannot be used. Some fear that these mutations can make harder to contain the pandemic. Even after a vaccine hits the market, it could lose effectiveness against virus strains that appear later. Dr. Shi says that COVID-19 could end up being like the Spanish flu, which caused a pandemic in 1918. It continued to mutate after that, reappearing as a seasonal flu. The 1918 pandemic influenza virus also called Spanish uh, flu. I think uh, after that pandemic, the virus adapt to human and we got seasonal flu. And it's very likely this um, SARS-CoV-2 yeah, cause COVID-19, COVID the disease, I think will um, continue yeah, for many years. Uh, yeah, it will become uh, like a uh, seasonal influenza virus. Dr. Shi says the world may need to brace for a long fight against the coronavirus. However, compared to vaccines for influenza, COVID-19 vaccines won't need as much updating. That's because the novel coronavirus mutates six to eight times more slowly than the flu. For most news, Stephanie Yang, Tsai Chen Yo in Taipei.